All right, in order to submit your enhanced podcast, you're going to upload the final file to YouTube. So first of all, make sure that you've saved it as either a WMV file if you're working in Windows Movie Maker or Photo Story 3, or an MP4 file if you're working on a Mac. So first of all, you're going to go to YouTube.com, and in the top right corner, you'll click on Sign In. Log in with your Google account information. And then you'll have a new set of tools that's available in the top right corner. You've got Browse, Movies, and Upload at the top. So browsing would just allow you to go through the different movies that are available on YouTube. Movies would let you see what you've already uploaded. And Upload will allow you to submit something new. So we'll click on that. And then click the big yellow Upload Video button. Go ahead and find whatever video it is you want to upload and click Open and then just wait for it to upload. While it's doing that, you may want to put in a nice title, something like five components of fitness vidcast. You could put in a description. And you can even put in tags like fitness and health might be tags that you'd use so that people can search more easily for your content. Then you would choose a category and we will choose education for our category. Make sure that you leave it public so that I can see it. Uh, but you could if you wanted to make it unlisted or even private and then just send the link to your students so that it's not easily searchable. This is a good idea for example if you are by any chance using copyrighted material and you don't want that uh, easily searchable online. All right, so you can do it either under a standard YouTube license, which would get, leave you with the copyright for that artifact, or you can put it under Creative Commons, which would allow anybody to reuse it. I, of course, encourage you to use Creative Commons licensing if possible, but in order to do that, you need to be the owner of all of the content of your, of your podcast. No copyright restrictions on that, okay? All right, once we're all done, we can save the changes. This has been completely uploaded, but it does take some processing time. So often your link won't work for a little bit. So you can see here I've got the green ribbon that says we are now processing the video. So it may not work for a little while. Once it's all done, you're going to come down here to the bottom where we've got the URL. Copy that link and paste it as your submission URL for the assignment today. That's it.